search the place! Do it! Now! Born! <laughs> you Dago cut! Born! <laughs> My house! Fuck! Ah.
Come on, Joe, don't tell me you're not home. Let's go. You better not be passed out. Come on! All your horses. I'm coming, I'm coming. What were you barbecuing in your underwears? Yeah. Can I come in? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, of course. I, I'll fix you a drink. What the fuck? Nice, ain't it? What the hell happened to this place? I spruced the giant up a little. What do you think? Yeah, it's really, uh... different. Yeah, huh? I decorated it myself. So what the hell happened? Here, take this. Those crazy fucking mix. What about them? What'd they do? They tried to fucking kill me. What? And they burned my fucking house down. Son of a bitch. So what are you gonna do? You wanna go deal with the mix right now? Damn right I do. All right, relax. Have a drink. Let me make a few phone calls. And, uh, take a look at my closet. Unless you wanna go on a rampage in your skivvies. Thanks. Thought you'd never ask. Hey, it's Joe. Yeah, I know, I know. But I need a favor. A bunch of mix try to kill a good friend of mine tonight. Point this house down. I want to know who they are and where they're operating out of. Hey, you're gonna have a lot worse to worry about if you don't tell me. Mickey Desmond. Oh, oh, he is. Well, that explains it. Where is he now? Yeah, yeah, I know the place. All right, thanks. Where are we going? The Hill of Tara, the Mick joint in Kingston. Come on, I'll tell you the rest in the car. Come on, get in. All right. So you heard anything about the mix lately? Nah, nothing. Why? The Mix got themselves a new boss. Name's Mickey Desmond. There's a few other guys who want to take his spot, so he's trying to show everybody that he means business. What the hell does that have to do with me? Brian O'Neill. He was Desmond's cousin. Ah, I should have known. My money's on him being down at that shithole joint right now, laughing it up with the rest of those fucking yo-yos. So let's get over there and deal with him. That's the plan. Sounds like there ain't many of them left, so I guess we should just storm the place, surprise the shit out of him. I like this plan. Assholes burnt my fucking house down. Relax, we'll be there in a minute. Shit, you're gonna need a piece. I almost forgot. Yeah, if you got one, that'd be good. If not, I'll just beat them to death with my bare hands. It makes no difference to me. Should be one in here somewhere. Ah, uh, here it is. Here you go. Thanks. Slow the fuck down before you get pulled over. Hey, go take a nap or something. Version to red lights? Ready, Vito? Come on, let's go get these fucks. I told you, I chased him, but I lost him. The coward ran away. But I'll find him. And when I do. You were the one who ran away, oh, asshole. Fuck. You... you've got some balls. Yes, I do. Run! <laughs> <laughs> 
Going in! Already oh, some shot. Let's go, Vito. Fuck, hurry up! I'm almost out of bullets! <clears throat> you don't look so tough to me! I won't want to get on your bad side. <clears throat> oh, another one bites the dust. What are you scared, asshole? <clears throat> oh, that's the best you got? Show yourself! Hey, there's more of them in that car. Let's go, they're getting away. All right, come on, you drive. Got some nut job here shooting a gun. Ten four. Let's go, Vito. We gotta get closer. Stop right there, stop. Trying to kill us? I told you. I chased him, but I lost him. The coward ran away. But I'll find him. And when I do... You were the one who ran away, oh, asshole. fuck. You... You've got some balls. Yes, I do. What are you scared, asshole? I'm going in! Oh. Fuck. Come on, think of something. Hurry up here. Come on, shoot the bastard. He don't look so tough to me. You that in the army? You should fight my sister. Uh, I'm the best. Come on, show yourself. Hey, there's more of them in that car. Let's go to getting away. All right, come on, you drive. Step out of the car, please, sir. Got some nut job here shooting a gun. Ten four. <clears throat> Copy that. Care of that. Stupid well, that takes care of that, huh? Yeah, but it don't give me my house back. Don't worry. Business is looking good. You'll have the cash for a new one real soon. Yeah, I sure as hell hope so. All right, let's go back home. So it's okay if I crash on your couch, right? I could do one better than that. Here, <clears throat> take these keys. They're for Marty's apartment. I'm trying to get rid of it right now for his mother. So 
So, uh, you might as well use it while I do. Thanks. I guess. Don't thank me, buddy. You're too old to be sleeping on my couch. Plus, I just bought the thing. I don't want you lousing it up. Marty's apartment's over in Oyster Bay. So you feel better now? I don't really. What we did back there doesn't even start to make up for it. Hey, all that stuff they got pointed up, it's just things, Vito. Just things? Hey, those were my things, Joe. Why do you think I do the shit we do anyway? It's to buy things. You know, suits, cars, broads, houses. Now I'm back to scratch. And all my damn cash was in that house, too. I promised myself I'd never be here yeah. again. Back me up, Vito. Subject is about six feet tall. Average size. Hey, hey, I understand. Don't worry, we'll think of something. You'll be back on your feet in no time. The glass is always fucking half full with you, isn't it? See you around, I guess. See you, buddy. Sorry about tonight. Yeah. What a fucking dump. God, I wish I had the cash for a hotel. Fuck, this is creepy. My house burned to the ground, along with almost every penny I had. There was even some trouble with the cops, but Eddie took care of that. And since I didn't have any insurance, I had to live in this shithole of an apartment till I could get back on my feet. At least I managed to save Leo. He disappeared.